This is the cell respiration experiment that can be found in both the biology with vernier and the advanced biology with vernier lab manuals. It's a popular experiment for general biology and one of the required experiments for AP biology. In this experiment, we will be using both a CO2 carbon dioxide gas sensor and an O2 or oxygen gas sensor to measure the amount of CO2 that's produced by germinating peas and the amount of O2 that's consumed by the peas. One nice thing about this experiment is that it can be performed in 10 minutes as opposed to the lengthy experiment required by traditional methods. I have some peas that have been soaking for a few days and have started to germinate. Measure out 20 to 25 peas and place them in the respiration chamber. Put your sensors into the biochamber. Now this is a biochamber 250 that allows to you to use both the CO2 and the O2 sensors at the same time. I'm going to put the oxygen gas sensor into the top of the biochamber and the CO2 gas sensor into the neck of the biochamber. Carbon dioxide gas is heavy and will lay down towards the bottom of the vessel. This orientation will allow you to pick up the CO2 earlier. Connect the sensors to any of the four ports on the top of LabQuest. The software auto-identifies the sensors and sets up data collection parameters that are perfect for this experiment. The CO2 gas sensor has a 90 second warm-up period. After 90 seconds, watch the CO2 readings to see that they've started to increase and start data collection. After 10 minutes, when data collection is finished, remove the sensors from the chamber, pour out the peas, and fill the bottle with water to flush out any remaining CO2. To find the rate of respiration, we need to find the slope of the CO2 and the O2 graphs. To find the rate of respiration on the CO2 graph, choose Analyze, tap Curve Fit, and choose CO2. From the pull-down menu, choose Linear and record the slope on your data table and tap OK. Similarly, repeat the process for the oxygen gas graph. As you can see, the graphs clearly indicate that carbon dioxide is being produced and that oxygen is being consumed while the peas are in the respiration chamber. Some variations on this experiment could include investigating the effect of temperature or the number of peas on the rate of respiration. This experiment lends itself very nicely to inquiry. Mm -hmm.